see, brother, as, as usual, we are here in peace. And uh, before we talk, please, can we have a word of prayer? Shut up and just say whatever you brought. You see, brother Lex, the devil is a liar. Amen. The Bible says we have overcome him by the blood and the testimony of our Lord Jesus. And you know definitely that to have an affair with a girl before marriage is a sin. And on top of it, to deny an issue out of it, brother, it is too bad. As I said, we are not here to condemn you. We are begging you in the name of God to reconsider your decision. For the Bible says if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us. So we are begging you in the name of our Lord Jesus to reconsider your decision, brother Alex. You see, brother, we all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. If you need any support in order to marry Sister Blessing, to save her from all this embarrassment, uh -huh. eh, let us know. We, we are willing to help you out. Please, Alex, for Christ's sake, I am not happy with her condition. She's been threatening to commit suicide. Please, whatever she has done wrong, please forgive her. We beg in you. Now, you guys should hear me out. I care less whether she dies or leaves. That is none of my bloody business. Yes. Yes. As I told you earlier, I came on a mission. And that mission is accomplished. You see, Brother Alex, I'm not trying to interrupt with your decision, but remember that mission that you are saying you have accomplished is leading you to death. For the Bible says the wages of sin is death. So, brother, in order to save yourself and Sister Mary from this kind of shame, please try to reason with us and reconsider your decision. God is there to forgive so that we can also help for you to marry Sister Mary, please. Now listen to me. I have nothing to reconsider. <sighs> That's all, Alex. You are not blessed at all. Will you shut up? Who is not blessed at all? Who is not blessed at all? I didn't know that I was coming to sit down to listen to recitation of foolish things. <sighs> Now get out of my house. This is ridiculous. Alex, are you that wicked? Now get out of my house. The Holy Book says not the truth and the truth shall say. You look stunning. Very beautiful. Thank you. What's your name? Nanama. Nanama? Wow. That's a nice name too. Thank Come on, can I offer you a lift to wherever you may be going? No, thank you. <laughs> have you haven't you finished? We can go. Let's go. Is that no Alex? Hey, right, Mosa, let's go. I beg, park in front of that car for me. Park there. Hey, okay. Alright, uh, good, that's it. What is it? Who is she? That's no problem of yours. What is it? Who is the lady in your car? Said that's none of your problem. Will you talk? Thank God I met you here. Yeah. 
I'm just from the hospital. And the doctor confirmed that I'm pregnant. What? How could you get yourself pregnant just like that? Are you a baby? Alex. Why are you talking to me like that? Why? When I told you, when I suggested to you that you use a condom, what did you say? I want you to feel like a real woman. I want to enjoy you. I like it raw. Yes, you fucked up. You fucked up big time. You could have protected yourself. There are a lot of contraceptives on the market. Listen, I'm not ready for this now. No. I'm not. There's no need to cry over spilled milk. I have the baby already. And what can we do? Just abort it. Simple. I can't believe you're talking like this, Hans. Abortion is not an option. Listen, you have no other alternative. The earlier, the better for you. Just abort this baby. So early tomorrow morning, just come home. I'll give you some money to sort yourself out. Don't do this. We have dated for some time now. <laughs> I'm your wife to be, remember, Alex? Your what? We're getting married. The cats are out. The venue is ready. Our parents are aware, the church, our loved ones. Oh. So, well, if I'm pregnant now, very soon. Well, later if they find out, we are already married. I love to hear that. The cars are out. The date is out. Have you forgotten that I'm the same person that schedules everything? And I can change it at any point in time. I don't care about it. And that's what you are supposed to know. I am not getting married. Did I ever tell you that I want to get married? Huh? Not now and not ever. That is what I want you to understand. Simple. Stop this joke. I don't like that, Alex. I don't like that. You, you have to be serious. I am not responsible for that thing you are carrying. Now get out of my way. Let me go. Are you denying me, Alex? I told you that I want no, to. Are you denying me? Oh, get out. Hey. Get out. Nonsense. Nonsense. Get out. Get out. Alex. What's the meaning of this? Hey! Accomplished. No, 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 no. To the successful completion of mission impossible. impossible. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to that. Hey. Oh, wow. Okay, so now, man, tell me, what's going on? You know that right now, you you come back to Shakespeare. <laughs> I mean, I thought, I thought, that Shakespeare may be for us, Junior Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Flow me some patwa, flow me some patwa. Don't be sick here. Hey, don't be sick. Ah, you go to sing Azuto in patwa. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Excuse me. 
me. I want to talk to you. No one is going anywhere. I came to stay to you. Ask me to. Well. I... I came to ask you if you have found a solution to my problem. You know the pregnancy is almost too much. Well, I was thinking of calling you early tomorrow morning. I'm actually traveling on a business trip. Tomorrow, yeah. <laughs> I told you earlier, I'm Find a solution to it. I am not responsible for that thing you carry in your womb that you call it. I need to stand fair in every decision I take. You know you're cool. Did I hear you? Who are you? You think you, 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 oh, you can do this in any way? Wow. Most of free? Or you think you can eat your cook and have it? Well, I think it is time I let you in on a little secret. I am not a born again. And certainly not interested in this biblical bullshit you call Christianity. Yes, ma'am. But sorry. Listen yes, to me. I came on a mission, and that mission is accomplished. <laughs> shut, shut. Voila. Yes, man. Mission complete. Completed. Hip, hip, hip. Hooray! Hip, 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 hip. Hooray! Hooray! Merry, 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 merry. Hooray! <laughs> God will surely punish you. <laughs> God will punish all of you. Oh, one by one. Yes. Hold on. God has already punished me. I'm aware of that. <laughs> Cast your mind back. Remember three years ago at the shopping mall. <laughs> It's my pleasure meeting you girls, okay? Wow, nice meeting you too. Great, great. <laughs> Do you have a minute? Oh yeah, sure. No, you. Yeah. Me? Yeah. Well, what for? If I may ask. Because I don't talk to strangers. Okay, I understand. Um, it's nothing bad, okay? Just that I've been observing you for some time now and... Actually, you don't know me, okay? But I'm your secret admirer. And by coincidence, we live in the same facility, you see. And I... I'm in love with you. Wow! Blessing, you've gotten yourself a secret admirer. And a lover boy too. He's so nice. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I see. Um, can I ask you something? I just want to know, are you a believer? Do you believe in Christ? Yes, no, yes. Uh, Do you? No. Oh, yes. Uh, no. No? Yeah. Then cut your coat according to your size. I? Because I don't compromise with local boys. Yes, um, okay. With this, you know, it doesn't really matter, okay? Because perhaps through you, I can get to know Christ and then become born again straight up. There's nothing wrong with that. You 
becoming a born again. Whether you become born again or not, I will still, like I said, do not compromise with local boys Come on. like you. Okay? Yes, I said, compromise my love for you. Come on. Yes, huh? But you know, I still love you, okay? Just give me some time. Could you please save yourself? Please don't let them harass me. Save your breath. Come on, boys. Yes, oh. Get in there. Come on. you right. I hate girls who try to play with the word of God. And I hate hypocrisy. This is a lesson to you all. If you are serving Christ, serve him well. And don't be a hypocrite. Now, get out of my house. born again Christian and a very strong one as such there is no turning back for me are you really sure you've made your mind to forgo the world yes I have but time will tell I have there is no peace in the world for me no peace in this world for me change? Are you sure you trust this man enough to entrust your life in his hands? I am praying for these people that you should change your ways. You should change your ways and do not be a hypocrite. Hallelujah. This son of ours is no different from a chameleon. A mess can never change. Young lady, I put it to you. This vagabond son of mine will deceive you. Go and find yourself a different man to marry. He's worse than a serpent. He will surely harm you, believe me. <laughs> See, we know his past. In fact, he himself confided in us about how promiscuous and ungovernable he used to be. Believe me, my dear, it's all in the past. Happening today, I need to stand firm in every decision I take. 
When I look in the mirror, I see but I see a chameleon. <laughs> And this idiot. Um, <laughs> um, look at me very well. Mm. You see my boots? Mm. Yeah. You see that? Mm. Uh, the movement. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Do I look like a father to you? <laughs> no, 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 no. You look like Charles Dickens. <laughs> <laughs> I am Jacob. I am Jacob. <laughs> I was about stepping out oh, to mm -hmm. somewhere, but uh -huh. um, because of this fun, yes. uh -huh. I would like to change plans. Okay. Uh -huh. to, so now uh -huh. we are going out to have a party. <laughs> Brother Lex, the devil is a liar. Amen. The Bible says we have overcome him by the blood and the testimony of our Lord Jesus. And you know definitely that to have an affair with a girl before marriage is a sin. And on top of it, to deny an issue out of it, brother, it is too bad. As I said, we are not here to condemn you. We are begging you in the name of God to reconsider your decision. For the Bible says if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us. So we are begging you in the name of our Lord Jesus to reconsider your decision, Brother Alex. You see, brother, we all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. If you need any support in order to marry Sister Blessing, to save her from all this embarrassment, yeah. eh, let us know. We, we are willing to help you out. Please, Alex, for Christ's sake, I am not happy with her condition. She's been threatening to commit suicide. Please, whatever she has done wrong, please forgive her. We beg in you. Now, you guys should hear me out. I care less whether she dies or leaves. That is none of my bloody business. Yes. Yes. As I told you earlier, I came on a mission. And that mission is accomplished. You see, Brother Alex, I'm not trying to interrupt your decision, but remember that 
mission that you are saying you have accomplished is leading you to death. For the Bible says the wages of sin is death. So brother, in order to save yourself and Sister Mary from this kind of shame, please try to reason with us and reconsider your decision. God is there to forgive so that we can also help for you to marry Sister Mary, please. Now listen to me. I have nothing to reconsider. Brother Alex, you are not blessed at all. Will you shut up? Who is not blessed at all? Who is not blessed at all? I didn't know that I was coming to sit down to listen to recitation of foolish things. Now get out of my house. This is ridiculous. Alex, are you that wicked? No, no, no. Oh, in fact, I'm very short. Oh, listen, ah. one more. You guys believe that you are serving the Lord with these girls. Listen to me. They are not Christian. They are not real or genuine Christians. As you think? Yes. What? Listen. They are wolves and the sheepskin. Brother Alex, are you saying our our, our girls are, are... No, 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 let, let, let me ask. Brother, no, no, you, you, you can't, can't, you can't, can't, you, can't. Let's go. you 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 can't. You can't. Let's you see, Alex, let's go. we will go. Let's go. Look at us. The way you say. He's dead. And the girls will die before me. Nonsense. Nonsense. Get out of my house. Go, go, go. Get out, get out, get out. Get out. Let's go. May God forgive me. Look at who is talking. May God forgive me. My dear, dry your tears. I warned you, but you were in last. How possibly could a person like Alex change overnight? It was a trap. Just as he has explained to you. But, we pity your condition. And I fervently hope that there's something we can do to help save the situation. By the way, how old is the pregnancy? <laughs> oh. It's nine weeks old. And I'm afraid my family and my church will soon find out. I, I warned you. You guys must be aware that Satan keeps on transforming himself into an angel of light. No, no, no. Calling our son Satan will not help solve the situation. What we have to do now is to look at a possible way of solving this amicably. After all, our son is not the only person to have impregnated a woman outside wedlock, is he? Ah, there you go again. I have always blamed you for, for uh, Alexis' misdemeanor. Well, you can find a solution to this, but as for me, I am out of it. You know me, you're walking out on us. We're supposed to go out. Hey. Hey. Oh. Hey. My dear. <laughs> My dear. Why is your tears? <laughs> Shall be alright, I assure you. Shall be alright. Shall be alright. <laughs> I'm dead, no. Mom. I am dead. No. Oh, I am dead. Oh. 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 